Here's one of the hardest lessons scapegoats and black sheep will learn as they heal. All the blame that was thrown at you, the judgments, the criticism, it wasn't that deep. The person who said those things to you wasn't thinking deeply about their words. They didn't know something about you that you didn't. They weren't seeing something in you that was broken. In fact, they didn't really know the real you because to judge and criticize in these ways requires disconnection. This is why if you ask them about a terrible thing they said to you 15 years ago, they might not remember it. It wasn't that deep for them. Many scapegoats are dumbfounded by the behavior of their family and get stuck in loops asking over and over again, why would this person say or do this to me? They keep saying I'm dumb. How could someone say I'm dumb so confidently, so repeatedly, if it wasn't based on something? And I'm here to tell you, it wasn't based on you. To ask why is to try to logic something that wasn't logical in the first place. Wounded people can do wounded things. They'll create a projection of who you are and compulsively attack you to keep you inside that box. I want to suggest redirecting your attention away from why. Because when you have taken big steps in your healing, why becomes a footnote. Understanding why is a fraction of the reward you get compared to learning who you are and actually becoming that person. Nurturing your whole self into being and knowing they can't stop you from doing that anymore. That process is worth so much more than understanding why.